Hi guys, in this video, we're going to take a look at the new iPhone 11, 11 Pro and the 11 uh, Max, how you can use the camera to take your photo photography to the next level with uh, uh, deep fusion technologies. So using uh, deep fusions uh, on the camera, basically it takes a series of photos, up to nine photos, and then it uses um, the, the new um, uh, processor uh, on the phone and it uses a new uh, um, software technologies that will process the image and basically it will take a lot of different photos uh, at the different exposures so some are uh, long exposures some are short exposures and then it will combine all that all those different uh, photos into one final image and will present you with the one very beautiful uh, image in the end now when uh, processing the image it will focus on uh, things like the texture of the photos the details and the noise and uh, the processing will be done uh, on a low level pixel by pixel and uh, basically it will look for like buildings uh, background like the walls the buildings and then it will look for things like your your hair your skin your face a facial uh, skin and then your clothes and then uh, it will compare uh, between different photos and then it combines uh, the best pixel into one photos and in the end you will have uh, one beautiful photos so um, it's only available on your iphone 11 11 pro and the 11 uh, pro max so if you're using other uh, mobile device you cannot use deep fusions and there's no settings uh, where you can turn it on or off so uh, unlike other features like hdr or smart hdr you can go into settings and you can switch it on and off with uh, deep fusions apple don't really want you to mess around with it they just want you to have um, to take beautiful photos so basically it will be automatics uh, at the moment it's only available on um, ios 13.2 beta so it's still in beta uh, until um, it's uh, publicly released you won't be able to uh, to use it so in settings and in general um, software update um, at the moment i have uh, installed um, ios 13.2 uh, beta so i have installed the beta profile on my device so i'm just going to look for profile so general profile should be somewhere in here. In here, so I have installed a uh, beta profile on this device. So that means when I'm taking a photos, I can um, uh, use the, um, I can use, you now with diffusions, it only works in a medium to low light environment. And all of this is done automatically. So the cameras will detect if you're in a medium to low light environment. And if you are, it will automatically use deep fusion to uh, process an image. So it uses an artificial intelligence uh, built into the phone. And then it will know if your environment has low light and then automatically deep fusion will kick in and uh, start to uh, take a lot of photos and then it combined together and it works on the background basically you won't notice it and it, everything is done on the background you take the photos the moment you tap on the shoot buttons and then within a seconds a lot of the photo has been taken and then at the back on the background it will process and then all that is done within a second or two so you hardly uh, will notice it so as uh, after sh uh, shortly after you press on the shoot button you switch over to your photo albums then all of that um, supposedly uh, is already done so you can see here uh, i have taken a photos this one here is in a very low light i close um, the closet door uh, it's, it's very low light and still you can see the photo is really nice and this one here is in uh, i'll open up the closet and it has a lot of lights coming in so you can see um it hardly is uh, there's any differences uh, between the two photos so yeah so those are the difference uh, between uh, using hdr uh, smart smart hdr and diffusion diffusion is allow you to take more beautiful more beautiful uh, photos in a medium to low light environment Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel for more videos.